since the first day. Uh, slam, busy, right? So we're gonna kick things off on the first floor. Go say hi to our friends, Chaos. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in to One Shot, One Kill. We are at SHOT Show 2020 with Joe at his booth, Chaos Concealment. Joe, absolute pleasure to hang out with you, man. Thank you for coming by. Let us know what you got for us. All right, so um, we have our Fusion line of holsters. This is our Fusion 2.0. Um, it's been around for a bit, um, so just going to do a rundown of what this one is. Absolutely. So this holster you can wear inside, outside, left-handed, right-handed. Yep. Right, so all you do is take that clip off, mm -hmm. you can move it to the other side, okay. you can adjust the cant, and they're all optic ready. Okay. So like if you're running an optic, whether it be an SRO, RMR, uh, Vortex, whatever it is, yep. um, it'll work. Another cool, cool. feature that uh, we don't normally talk about too much is that you can actually take a magazine, rack around into the chamber. Oh, no Right, kidding. you can chamber check it while it's in the holster. While it's in the holster. You can get to the magazine release, take the magazine out. Okay. And then if you wanted to disarm it, you can disarm it while it's in the holster. Awesome. So it keeps the trigger guard covered all the time. The entire time and you still have capability. Wow, that's a nice deep cut out there. Yep. Fully ambidextrous, of course. And Very even with cool. the SRO being a bigger optic. Yeah, um, I was gonna say. Like this SRO. one right here, you know, with the RMR, it's still, still fun. Wow. Very cool. Very cool, man. Yeah, impressive stuff. Now, the torch. The, that one's our Fusion 2.0. This is a Fusion 2.0. Yeah. Okay. Now we'll, I'll, I'll show you the torch right now, awesome. but just to kind of show you the capabilities, like these holsters here, they're all the same, right? So let's say you want to take this holster, and let's say you're wearing a suit, yep. um, or you're going to church or something, you want to tuck your shirt in over your holster. Yep. Well, you can do that. You don't got to buy another holster. You just buy an accessory. Okay. So you can buy this accessory and make it tuckable, uh, right? So you can do different things with it. Yeah. Um, let's say you're not wearing a belt one day, or um, you know your wife wearing a gun, she's not wearing a belt, or she's yep. wearing you know yoga pants, or whatever it might be. Yep. Um, our holster's compatible with the Ulti Clip. So instead oh, of right. buying another holster, you just buy the Ulti clip and it works yeah. with our holster. Um, if you're ever at a, like, taking a class, you're at a range, um, and you need an outside of the waistband holster, yep. well, instead of buying another outside of the waistband holster, all you would do is buy the paddle and then you can convert it into a paddle holster. Perfect. So that'll allow you to take one holster and make it do pretty much anything you need it to do. Versatility. Yeah. Yeah, that's um, key nowadays. And then, like, you know, it'll work with our, our claw that we have, so it'll help with concealment. You can awesome. run it with two loops. Awesome. Um, so all these are the same exact holster, different mounting options. Very cool. Um, so they're, Soft they're loops, you got the concealment claw. Yep. Very cool. Tuckable clip. Yep, tuckable. Multi-clip. Very cool. So that's that's the Fusion 2.0. All right. Um, the model that's been really popular for us that we showed and introduced last year, more like in the prototype status, yep. was our, um, our Fusion Porch. Fusion Porch. So this one right here is our light bearing holster. Um, right now we have it for the Streamlight TLR1 HL, okay. and we have it for the uh, Surefire X300. Okay. Um, what makes this one cool is it takes all the capabilities of our other holster as far as inside, outside, left-handed, right-handed, yep. but now you can wear it with a light. Um, uh, these holes will allow you to mount it to anything. So let's say you have um, a Blade Tech or a Blackhawk um, or um, whatever other you know mounting system, it'll yep. work with that. So okay. you don't have to buy different mounting systems or proprietary to us, you can wear it with anything. So awesome. a really popular one for this model is the, the RTI mount. Awesome. So you can and actually that's really take keeping the end user in mind. You're obviously yep. keeping the end user in mind, just saying that people have different preferences. Yeah, or you, they don't want to spend a ton of money, like you know, buying. Well, now I have to buy this accessory and have yeah. to buy you know a whole new setup for, yeah. for the Blackhawk. So yeah, um, absolutely. That's so that paddle on there, uh, same exact holster on this one, right? Yep. So that one right there is for a Glock. But keep in mind, this holster right here is now mounted to a G-code. G-code. And is upgraded to a level two, still optic ready, right? Oh, very um, cool. So you can you can upgrade it to pretty much do whatever you need to do. Yep. So you can still chamber check it. You can still do all of that good stuff with this holster. Level two retainment. Level two retainment. G code compatibility. Yeah. Now we will uh, this year be coming out with our own proprietary not proprietary but our own brand okay. of a drop leg, um, and then we'll also have like a off the belt like about two or three inch drop um, capability as well. Awesome. But it'll be a chaos brand, awesome. and then we'll have an attachment here we can unbuckle it. Um, but cool. Right now we're we it'll still be capable of everything, but we'll just have our own. That'd be a little bit more uh, cost effective as far as okay. uh, you know. The Very cool, man. It. Oh, yeah, that's the, the torch. But let me show you uh, the other cool. capability. Let me, um, you got it. Let me just right grab here. one of those over there. So like that's the STI, and Ooh, the one next nice. to it, the one next to it, we're gonna grab that one too. So this one shows you more of the capability of uh, of the inside the waistband, right? Yep. So if you want to run in the waistband with a light, so have the two soft loops, yep. but you can still run it with any of the other clips that we have here. So whether it be the tuckable clip or whatever it is, ulti clip, you can still ulti run it with clip, this tuckable. Um, with the wing. Yep. It'll still work with an optic. Yep. Uh, and you can still chamber check it. And then we also have the yeah. capability of running it, have an STI, the staccato, um, whatever it might be, you can run it with mm -hmm. an STI. So that's wow. one of the, the, the 2011 styles. Yep. 1911 uh, MMP. Amazing firearm, by the way. Yeah. Amazing firearm. And now you got, it looks like an, a highly modular holster. Mm -hmm. 
and obviously keeping the end user in mind. This is, I mean, inside the waistband, outside the waistband, soft loops, uh, tuckable, clip, you name it. It's gonna fit your needs. And then just to show you this one, uh, this one's a, a Glock 41. So if you have a Glock that's in 45 yep. ACP, yep. it's still accommodated. Wow. So. Wow. So it works. Yeah. Oh, you got some amazing work on here on the grip, by the way. Yeah, We're gonna have to get you a nice close-up image of what he's got going on here. Chaos concealment. Yeah. That's a custom work uh, by Wayne Hammer with uh, right now he's with MLS yep. uh, firearms. Wayne Hammer, right on, man. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, great work right there. Fantastic holster, dude. Fantastic holster. Extremely compatible with absolutely everything on the market. A lot of the stuff on the market, not everything. Uh, but uh, fantastic, man. Definitely uh, will meet everybody's training needs. Yeah. What else you got, bro? So for uh, for new that we have this year, well, it's, it's newer in the sense of like we're doing more mainstream. We, we always had it. Yep. Um, but we're doing a uh, magazine holster. It's a little bit different from what we have already. Okay. Um, this one will allow you to wear outside the waistband a little more secure okay. because it works with the tech locks or uh, these mounts here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, and what makes this a little bit more different and more versatile is that it'll work with pretty much any magazine chamber to 9 or 40. You have an adjustment here. This is made by uh, the attachments made by Tolster and uh, it's called the MRD. Okay. But our holster is compatible with it as well, so you can actually wear it and mount it to do anything. And what's important here, um, from my experience, the MRD is really cool because you're not applying, you're not pinching down on yep. this portion of the holster and applying pressure only on the back piece of the magazine. And uh, what you're actually doing is you're tightening this, uh, this screw here, this Allen screw here, and it's applying pressure on the back and pushing forward. So you get even pressure all around instead of yeah. just a pinch point on the back. And Very so I've cool. always I've always liked it. I've used it occasionally, um, but for what we're trying to do as far as like, and I'll move into like our duty belt, mm -hmm. we're trying to um, accommodate more like law enforcement. We're doing a lot with corrections, working yep. with LAPD on certain projects, yep. um, which I can go over to. Well, I probably won't go over that one, but I'll go okay. over this. All right. Um, so that, that's going to be kind of a, a step into our watchman duty belt. Right so on. this is our two inch belt. We do a Cobra buckle on all of our, our belts that we offer. Yes, they so do. This one's cool. <laughs> Uh, and that one's our EDC belt. This um, is your EDC belt. Yeah, so our EDC Buckle. belt. Um, we call it EDC, obviously EDC belt, but uh, we, we do it as everyday citizen belt. Oh, very cool. So that's why the EDC comes into play. So it still works. So, like if you look at my sign, it says everyday citizen. Yeah, it sure does. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, yeah, so this is our duty belt. So this awesome. is our, our version of like either for security, um, law enforcement, if they're allowed to wear something like this. Yep. So you got an inner belt that you wear. And then all you do is get this all geared up with all your yep. mag carriers, your holster, or anything you have on it. Yep. All that weight you can just take off, put in your seat, yep. car, and your trunk. Um, I got some some guys, you know, you know, kick doors down every day, and they, yep. they keep their gear in their their yep. trunk or in their in their truck, and they just want to throw it on. Yep. And so they, they like this idea. Yeah, um, absolutely. And then being two inch, it's pretty standard for them, anyways. Sturdy and standard. Yeah, yep. absolutely, absolutely. The cool feature about these uh, you know these double layered belts is. Not only do you have, you have the inner belt, you can use it kind of as an everyday, but it's really easy to take off and put on. And what that does is that guarantees kind of that muscle memory that you build during training. It guarantees that everything goes back in the exact same place. What it reminds me of is my competition rig. Yeah. I got a competition rig, same thing. I got my magazines right where I want them, angled, canted right where I need them. I got my holster right where I want it. Just take that off, set it aside, and I still have a belt that keeps my pants on, right? Yeah. <laughs> and then uh, once, once it's time for competition, Go grab the outer belt, slap it on, everything's in place, hasn't moved one bit. So, yep. really good, man. Very nice. And, and that another, another cool thing we're amazing. doing um, with that, that magazine holster yep. is um, there's some that are market that are similar. Obviously, being holsters, everything's kind of running into each other, different yeah, brands. Absolutely. Um, so, we try to be a little bit different in the sense of what we do. Mm -hmm. But this one, you can you, at the end of the day, when we're 100% done with it, you're going to be able to adjust it to any degree that you want. Oh, awesome. Um, or some of them, they're, you have to either go forward, back, or, or straight. Yeah. Ours, you can be able to adjust it to exactly where you want it and tighten okay. it down. All right. so that'll be a little bit different for us. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, most most places they have either either this, this, yeah. or this. So either ours are gonna have a, a similar spacing that. like you see on uh, this, whole, like you see the slot. Oh, It'll perfect. have a slot like that. We can actually adjust it. Right on, man. A little more fine tuning on your on your setup. Awesome. Yeah, well, it sounds like you guys are obviously uh, doing everything in your power, keeping the customer in mind, keeping the end user in mind, law enforcement, military, ex-military, security forces, so on yep. and so forth. Uh, that's fantastic work, man. Uh, this definitely sells, and uh, just because me as a consumer, end user, this is exactly the stuff that I'm looking for. Mm -hmm. Can I adjust it? Is it modular? If I want to go from inside the waistband to outside the waistband, can I actually do that? Answer here, absolutely. Yep. And then we always, like I said, I do a lot of interaction uh, in the beginning, like at gun shows and stuff, so I always hear that story, you know, I got a drawer full of holsters, yes. I got a box full of holsters, so yes. for me it's like you can buy one holster, maybe you have a little bit of accessories, but you have one holster that'll do yeah. a lot of different things for you. Yeah, absolutely.
With the right belt, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was kind of a natural progression. Yeah. I'd always get asked, like legit, like people would ask me, you know, what belt should I use? What belt should yeah. I use? So I was like, yeah, I'd always recommend like SOE gear or like, yeah. you know, Blue Alpha and all, all great. And I was like, well, you know, I can sew, I'll make some belts and go from there. And so far it's been good. Yeah. Right on. Joseph, we really appreciate your yeah. time, bro. Thank you, you got some fantastic by. stuff. And uh, we'll be back here to check out some more, right? Yeah. Okay, awesome. Okay.